weiterhin Standbild bis zur letzten Sekunde. Ja. Ähm. Okay. <lacht> Moment, nur Sano. Äh. Okay, no Sino. Weiß wer no Sino. Very sorry guys. Uh ah, no, it's back. Okay, um Okay, uh it's rare for you to get something like this. So, um yeah, I am back. Uh so we're just gonna here uh, go into vlog and just uh, don't need any more trouble. listen to this. Guys, help! I've only been looking at Jack dudes and anime girls, and I have no idea what real women look like anymore. Can he stop looking at porn? Well, uh, yeah, sure. Stop looking at porn. This game is being so matter. Calling card. Anything else in there? Who's this from, anyway? So basically, the uh, Joker uh, opened the letter. And uh, it's a calling card. Uh, there's a calling card in there. So... There's no stamp on it. Someone must have directly dropped it into the mailbox here. I'm assuming you're real. What? We are real? Mark, are you are you real? Are you even here? Or did the uh, uh, Discord broke as well? Mm, could it have been Alibaba? That reminds me. He did mention something about preparing the necessary tool. Don't tell me. Is this what he was talking about? So basically Alibaba made a calling card for them to send off. And we can see uh, Joker's phone. It's... Uh, I think it's an iPhone look. What the hell's going on here? All we can do at the moment is wait for Alibaba's orders. It's not an iPhone actually, because we've clearly seen that it's not one. Let's brace ourselves and stand by. In case anything comes up. Oh dear. Look at all the food we're having. started turning the heat up on the forum. I put a special post up and everything. So basically you got a hate group going. What should Scarlet be wearing? What about nothing? Uh, I think the calling card is actually blank. Yeah, we have a Twitter mob now. The showdown between the Just Fanta face and the global organization Magic is here. I reckon it's been great too, everyone is getting really engaged. I need to post this to places. Yes, like my DM. Some of the most comments have been pro Phantom Thieves. Oh no shit, Sherlock on a Phantom Thieves aficionado website. Who would have thought that the Phantom Thieves would get the most support? Phantom Thieves need your help, Caddy. 
You need to provide more rail. <laughs> Luckily, because of what happened to Kaneshiro case, most of ever said they measured are hackers of justice. But they're nothing resembling justice in what they do. How do you know, Bishima? How do you know? Someday I want my whole site to be filled with pro thieves comments. Yeah, I'm back now. Ah, welcome back. Oh, I see you. I have a conversation with that dude at the moment. Yeah, Bishima. I'm looking forward to when the day finally arrives. Yeah, Bishima is just uh, promoting a Twitter mob on the uh, Phantom Thieves fa fan site. He can look forward to whatever he wants, but if you have no means of striking back against magic. Now I'm sleeping. Actually, I'm not. Mm. What the hell is going on? I can act I actually can't do anything. Don't do that today. We have to sleep. We will defeat magic by sleeping. I agree. We shall sleep to win. I don't think you can. Just plain. But you can try it. And there's still that guy playing his PS Vita. What do you think about PS Vita? There's someone playing a PlayStation Vita. You see it? Yes, I know. That's what I was commenting on. And and that guy playing the PS Vita is actually sneezing on everybody. That's exactly what I said in the moment you said it. Yeah. I can't believe it. Suddenly you're not knowing what they're going to do to us. A clear victory. I wish they'd stop that. People can't take the online drama. Yes, Morgana. Talk while during the lecture. Let's look at the phone while the lecture. Come on. <laughs> it's just Ryuji. Oh, he's not important. He doesn't How the hell is Morgana even fitting to the desk? Because cat. If the cat fits, it sits. In this case, Morgana is fitting quite nicely under the desk. Nothing. I thought he's human. No, but he's a cat. And, and he's a bus. He is a cat and a bus. There's no ASAP if he tries to get in touch with you, okay? I think he's a human cat. A human? So, so he is a furry? If you can, he just never shuts up, does he? Good day! Good day to you too! Ah, you responded today. Once again, I am Alibaba. You are the leader of the Phantom Peeps, correct? Who are you again? I already said, I am Alibaba. Bliat. <laughs> I take you received the calling card. <laughs> are you at school right now? Who are you again? <laughs> we can... I'm in class. A surprisingly delicate student. Oh, Alibaba didn't think about that I would actually be a productive member of society. Woo. <laughs> now then, I have prepared a calling card for you. And now you're going to steal it. Steal from... <laughs> who are you again? <laughs> steal from who? What do you mean by that? Are you able to steal a heart as long as you have a calling card? Hmm. Tell him. Hey, hey. You need the name of a target. Steal from who, I think. What's the target's name? A name? Is your heart fever truly impossible without such information? It is. I see. Suppose past calling cards did have names on them. Sometimes you can, you can just keep on who are you again. <laughs> we aren't talking with Akechi. <laughs> One moment. Alright, I'll tell you. I believe the name was Futaba Sakura. Hmm, where have we heard Sakura again? Hmm. Have you heard the name Sakura, Mark? Hmm. Very suspicious. Yeah, I do. Have you? 
Yeah, I think I, 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 I think, I think I have heard the name Sakura. If you fail in this mission, I will expose your identity to the mob and to the police. Well then, I shall, I'll be counting on you. We shall speak again after the change of heart. Well, there are a lot of Sakura guys, girls in Japan. Nothing to worry about. Who is Futama Sakura? Can't find my counter guess and the response to all I get back is error message. For real? Oh fuck, uh, Morgana did it for real. Okay, uh, just wait a second, I'll get a second drink. Because we need a for real drink! You actually have a for real drink? Have? I don't have any drink in terms of alcohol. So for um, explanation mark, well, we, for real. we have it's a for real. yeah for real. It's a fake. It's serious. Yeah, it's um, basically uh, we have a drinking game on uh, Persona Five streams. Whenever somebody says uh, for real, I have to drink. You have. Yes, because this is a drinking game, and the thing to drink to is somebody saying for real. I think I, you will be an alcoholic. Uh, after finish the game. Yes, we should have actually had a for real counter uh, right from the beginning. I would actually be interested in seeing how often for real is being said. And Sakura, I feel like I have heard that name before. Hmm, when should when did we hear that name? In any case we should let everyone know about this. I'm not an alcoholic. Well, for, for real, it's used by Morgana and Ryuki. And uh, on is also very heavy in uh, for reals. And I'm not an alcoholic. I can stay perfectly sober. Mark, Mark and Kip can yes. attest to that. Yes, no. I can. I'm, I'm not a gin fly. You can. What? I, I can stay perfectly sober. You just get deep in thought. <laughs> oh yes, he's doing the thinking uh, posture. Taba Sakura? Wasn't Sakura? It's bosses last It's a bosses. It's bows. Yes, Makoto also threatened to release pictures and chat logs and everything. Does he have any Bowser. family? Bows. Does he? Because everybody calls him Bows. Oh For god. Reals? How we back <laughs> For reals? <laughs> For reals? Normally be introduced at least. I mean, you are living at his place. Well, his situation does make things difficult. The calling card was delivered to Boss's house. It'd be more natural to assume this is all related. One of the reasons for that is because Alibaba mentioned nothing about which Futaba Sakura. Perhaps he thinks that the name alone is enough. That makes sense. I believe it's adequate for us to think that this is the doing of someone close by. I see. I don't know how Alibaba got a hold of his smartphone information. Because Deku Kun is very bad with internet security. He doesn't even have a password. However, since he's ordering us through chat, I do feel as though he's taunting us. You mean this might just be a prank? I mean, look at his demands. Pay me if you don't want me to leak who you really are. That Anybody could get into Deku? <laughs> Deku didn't turn up location tracking. Yeah, location tracking basically uh, is super hard to turn off on Android devices. It's uh, surprisingly easy to just let it be turned on and then have uh, 
map of where I went for like the past three years. It's very creepy. But he's telling us to steal someone's heart without explaining why. So we're being tested. Regardless, I think we should ask Boss about Futaba Sakura once. That's probably for the best. There's nothing else we can do at the moment, and Chief might have an idea on what this is about, too. Or you can take your phone with your draw dick with your trajectory on the map. What the fuck? <laughs> and Kip uh, shilling for Apple again. Check the school's roster just in case. You must make sure boss doesn't figure out who we are. We'll have to go about this cautiously. Hmm? Oh, he's What's having up? a smoke inside the cafe. Want to meet Futaba. Why do you know about that? Oh, the music stopped. Hmm. It's got nothing to do with you. I'm going home. Make sure you lock up the place. Like it's a hit. Take your time. Oh, so you're getting flustered. Yeah, he's getting very flustered. Are you able to ask boss about Tavasakura? He didn't want to talk. Ooh. That'd be our only hope in defeating Magid. I wish we could get some info about Futaba out of both. But trying to force it out would probably have a positive effect. Discord. Yes, a source of Discord. We all want that source of Discord, don't we? Because it's proprietary and we want it to be free. Source of Discord. Yeah, we want the source code. Crackers has called out the Phantom Thieves. Our show managed to get a calling card left by, as it says here, the Phantom Thieves of Hearts. I may also tell you that they make your targets confess their sins. Let's sit on the sofa. Mm. That's our thinking sofa. And now we're gonna go to bed. Mm. We shall sleep. Because we need some sleep. Really have a thinking sofa? Yes, Joker has a thinking sofa. Ha have you never sat on that sofa and f just thought about stuff? Yo. Tomorrow's the end of the first semester, but we still got all this lame shit coming up. If you don't take care of this lame shit, you can kiss your summer vacation goodbye. Oh yeah, about this Tama Sakura though. She's related to both. I think people living nearby would know about her. Wow. That's some keen intuition coming from you, Ryuji. You should have made use of that on your exams. Oh, it's just... It's just so much salt into the wound. I don't know how Ryuji survives that. I wanna never think about exams ever again. Asking around your neighborhood might be the fastest way to figure this shit out. You know, I doubt it would be that easy. Never eh. Never be. <laughs> uh, 
The summer vacation starts the day after tomorrow. Don't forget. Actually, uh, now that I think about it, the day after tomorrow is... Um, we have a word for that in German that apparently doesn't have any translation for uh, any other language. So all the other languages are very complicated saying but for the day after tomorrow and in German we just have uh, Übermorgen. Oh, actually, actually there is. So is it just English that doesn't have uh, equivalent to that? And related languages? Yeah, I think it's just English. Really just English? I I thought actually that there were more languages like that. I stand corrected. Take a semblance. Unusual number of strange incidents this year. Don't do anything stupid over break. Get it? Don't go somewhere less shady like a red light district. And don't go off, go to the beach after dark. Well, now you we, now we should know what to do on summer break. I'm gonna go to the beach and drop some cold water. You're a cat. Why does Morgana want to jump into cold water? He's a cat. Please He's explain. not a cat. He is a cat! Mm. No, he's a human. He's a cat! He's a fluffy, cuddly little cat. How much do you bet we were going to be beached in the dark? I could have should ask that. Well, you are a cat as well. Head to Jongen. Do you want to head to Jongen as well? See. Be cautious of magic. Look into Futaba Sakura. Is another that name I heard somewhere before? Name from my very first love. My teacher back when I was in elementary school. Dazed old man. Okay, let's walk around. Oh, there's a neighborhood housewife. Sakura sounds single, right? Be I right back. Yeah, I thought he didn't have any children. Wasn't there some drunk guy around here? Oh, the drunk guy suddenly vanished. Oh wait, there's an old man. Do we want to listen in? You think the Phantom Thieves... Oh, he's a DJ. You think the Phantom Thieves are a dangerous society? Send us your opinions by email or fax. By fax! By fax! Unreal. No way people like that are real. Game console. Could I actually sell it if I threw in some games? I'm not really sure anyone could buy a game console that's this old though. Oh, we can buy a game console. Well, the Japanese use facts to this day. I do that could be. Okay. Let me go to. Okay, we can't go to Takemi and ask her. Shopper! Who knows? Oh wait, we eat a lot. Hey, I'm a have you boy. ever done that mini game? I think it's uh, the home run game? I have done the home run uh, once on stream and once on my actual first save, but I've never done well on it. Tell me you don't actually eat that much, maybe it's boss who eats a lot then. Okay, we can't go to the supermarket, even though it's open. Why is old man? Don't, I don't think I know anybody by that name. Hmm. Delivery company man.
Tower no, don't know anyone like that. I come to Sakura Sons often to make deliveries, but never seen who you were talking about. Mm. Boss buys a lot of food, far more than enough for one person living alone. Let's check out all the shops where I can buy food. Okay. Can we now go to the supermarket? Sons, ever anything. Sorry. Come again. That doesn't look like it'll work. You only have to go home and ask the chief directly. Oh, he's sigh again. You read the letter, did you not? So you're the one who tipped him off about Futaba. You really shouldn't have done that. I have no intention of talking to you about Wakaba. Tipped off? What are you talking about? Back to the matter at hand. Your parental authority will have to be suspended. I take it you're okay with that outcome? What? Considering the state of your daughter and your family overall, there are no points Whoa. in your favor. Would you like to take this to domestic court? Our chances of victory are roughly 99.9% .9 though. With these suspicions of abuse, there's no way you could avoid having your custody revoked. You're going that far? I told you I don't know a damn thing about it! We're extremely serious about this. As long as there's a possibility that cognitive science can be linked to psychotic breakdowns, I yield. Thank you. I will contact you at a later date. I doubt you'll find anything you want to hear, though. That's fine. It will be up to us to decide whether the information you give us is useful or not. Next time I come here, it will just be for a nice cup of coffee. And she's all smiling. Oh, I just want a cup of coffee. Oh. And by the way, I want your daughter. Stay out! That woman is real good at pissing people off. <sighs> What's with that huh? look? You got something to say? Dojo is, is uh, damn. Yeah, he's easy to tick off if you push the right buttons. This doesn't involve you. Custody. <laughs> Where's Futaba? Uh, that's enough. Just behave yourself and keep going to school if you don't want me to throw you out of here. You got that? Lock Kenny, you can always watch the rest of the stream when I put it up on YouTube. That's fine. Thanks for being here at all. And uh, please draw Scarlet. It'd be, it'd be much appreciated. Mm. The existence of this Futaba is for certain. She may be in some kind of bad situation, though. More so, our conjecture that Alibaba is connected to LeBlanc seems to have a pretty solid foundation. Good night. Oh, and didn't they mention cognitive something? I wonder what the chief's hiding. We can't really press him on the subject, though, especially after he mentioned throwing you out. Mm. Can you do that uh, sound Morgana's making the? And again, you can't even do a 
I can do nothing. Yeah. I can only sleep. One of the things I don't like about the game. Yeah. Yeah, Mac, uh, Morgana's uh, telling you to go to sleep pretty often. Yeah, she was going on about domestic abuse and taking the case to court and stuff. Oh. What's up? It's nothing. So to summarize what you told us, Futaba is boss's daughter, and he's abusing her? I don't know him very well. Is he really the kind of person who would do that? <laughs> There's no way. I would like to believe so as well, but we don't have any conclusive evidence, do we? Maybe. Is it Alibaba? Give me a calling card and talk to you the target's name. You should be ready for this. Why aren't you doing it? I told you I'd help you if you stole her art. What seems to be all up? Said I reported it at Jeff Police if you didn't help me. Serious here. A selfish <laughs> person. Very desperate uh, uh, well, he does as well. Information on us. Anyways, this Futaba he's talking about have a palace? If so, I need keywords to get in. Try messaging him about it. Keywords? What are you talking about? Saying many stuff to touch the issue. What are we supposed to do about this? We'd be able to figure out Alibaba's identity if we could just meet with him. Try asking him if there's any way we could meet up. That would be difficult. Reasons for not being able to go out. So I'm contacting you like this. He can't go out? It's two people's hearts directly, but mind making is difficult. Extremely difficult. Hold on. Thinking. Steal off. Stop looking into Futawa Sakura. Forget this ever happened. I won't report you to police either. Don't worry. Sorry for taking your time. Now please excuse me. Who are you? Said the deal's off. I'm going to speak again. Don't expect me to contact you uh, anymore either. Why are you doing this? And error message. Huh? Did he just shut the whole operation down? This doesn't make any sense. Not only can Alibaba not go out, but he won't let us meet Futaba either. Well, it's none of our business now. Can't contact him anymore. But what do we do about Mejed? We won't be able to get Alibaba to help us with them now. Maybe they were just pranking us. They made that huge declaration, but they ain't done nothing since. <laughs> I bet we got them freaked out. You mean they backed out because they're afraid we'll change their hearts? Yep. And now it'd just make them look lame if they came out and apologized. But. I guess with Alibaba and Medjet out of the picture, can we just say this case is closed? You do have a oh, point. Oh my god, we're agreeing with Ryuji. Oh fuck. I guess it is safe for us to relax a little. Oh yeah, remember Kanashiro's treasure? Prepare to have your mind. Oh, Ryuji is gonna. This might be the only time in the game where Makoto is. Uh, yen out of it. We have something Ryuji mentions here. Yeah. And Ryuji got 150,000 yen out of it. That's awesome! We can really go all out with that kind of money. Yeah! Let's make up for what happened at the fireworks festival. Gotta go eat something fitting for the Phantom Thieves' worldwide debut. Mm, where would be good? Ooh, how about sushi? I could really go for Oh, sushi! Too. Do you want sushi? The best method is to fill yourself on ginger before beginning Probably to eat I sushi. Don't. That is my So you need technique. to eat ginger before eating sushi. That's Yusuke's master technique. Do you agree with that? You don't need to do that this time. Actually, I don't. definitely don't do it. Okay. okay, you don't. Sorry, you're not actually going for sushi. I don't belong in the sushi. So you don't. I'm more so like a fan of. Okay, so, so, so you, so you, uh, pass the sushi to Morgana, and have something else. Yeah. I'm all for sushi. You're okay so Morgana's all in for sushi. So what would you want then?
Sushi's fine. Then it's decided. I don't think I'm going for pizza. All right. The pizza. We'll tomorrow night. So pizza, it is. Done or something yet? Ghost Town Fantasy, so I should not be acting now. They're taunting us, but we best was to come up with a countermeasure regardless. We should caution each other sushi, that's all we could do. Oh, yes, we are gonna like. Oh, yes, I'm eating sushi. I'm very wary about my surroundings. I'm gonna grab the sushi. I'm gonna eat it. I'm looking to my left and to my right while I eat the sushi. Also, all non suspiciously. And then I'm gonna chew in the sushi and gonna enjoy it. But at the same time, I'm not gonna, gonna enjoy it because I'm cautiously looking at everything. So oh, fun. First celebration party, too. Cheer up, Makoto! <laughs> we'll be eating sushi like kings tomorrow. Not like one person's particular is on the best behavior. I refrain from saying who, though. <laughs> and Ryuji's barking. Suspicious sushi. Just try to uh, say suspicious sushi three times in a row, but very, very quickly. I should write something. Just gonna save uh, regardless because we are nearing the end of the stream, but I think we should see the next day at least. Well, then. I don't know how long it's taking. Tell him who's just. Next day is a nice one. 24th? The sushi one? Oh, here we see it. You seem quite busy, Sai san. I take yeah, it you're stuck in the middle so of the So it's a. So far, but for now, daytime, we see Akechi and Sai. And Akechi is saying, Oh, Sai san, you are very busy. The Phantom Thieves made a mockery of us when they brought down Kamashiro. And, the, and Sai is all emo about the Phantom Thieves stealing their fame. To make matters worse, Medjid, who has been dormant for some time now, just declared war. Oh, basically. Oh, I am so sad because fuck that. That there are two people, uh, groups of people, having a gang war, and I don't like it. It's so stressful. How much more can they screw us over? Sai, look at that like that. If they destroy each other, problem solved. Dresses bad for the skin, you know. Did I catch you just accuse Sai of being ugly? Mark, do you f do you think that the catchy is uh, accusing Sai of being ugly? No, I don't think so. I think he just points out that Sai is getting older. Oh yeah, calling her old too would be very bad. <laughs> She's ugly on the inside. Did you come all this way simply to be sarcastic? How about you listen to my deductions for a change of pace? I don't like this guy. Well, nobody likes this guy, and nobody likes this woman either. But let's see. Akechi is going on about deductions now. Let's listen to that guy. You may think it absurd, but don't you think the case you're pursuing and the actions of the Phantom Thieves overlap somehow? What are you basing this off of? The one point of commonality across all cases is how those involved have an unforeseen change of heart. I've suspected that myself, but those suspicions are unfounded. I told you at the beginning that this was only a deduction. Ask catchy. These just phantom thieves are riling up the public. However, that <laughs> I'll say. I'll say. <laughs> true goal is terrorist action by way of psychotic breakdowns. Is that too much? There's nothing at the moment that falsifies that claim. Well, that sounds like a in Dante. <laughs> we aren't detectives. We are not detectives. We are the dinner police. Me and Dante are exploding cars and having kebab. 
you mention this to the police? I'd never tell them such things. Oh, obstruction of justice. Nice, Akechi. The only value they have to me is in their mobility and organizational capabilities. Cave up elf. <laughs> it seems having you lend me a hand has paid off. Yes, it, it is indeed a great pun. I'm glad to hear that. What about your case, Sai san? Did you learn anything from the guardian of that mental shutdown victim's daughter? Oh, mental shutdown victim's daughter. Nothing at all. I see. Now, what should my next action be for our victory? Handle the phantom thieves without remorse. Use any means necessary to win. That's how I would deal with them. Yes, so Jiro would be the guardian. <laughs> Very well. This seems to be fun for you. Are you on to something? No, not at all. Well then, to our victory. He should declare this a victory way before he actually won. Don't, don't you think that uh, he okay. is a bit quick to say, hey, uh, we won, basically? Time for sushi. This place is in Ginza, right? Do we take the usual trade from Shibuya? Well, we do apparently. Well, I think that's how he is. Everybody's amazed at the sushi. Man, the flounder is out of this world. Mm. And Ryoji is talking about food again. Well, one thing Ryoji got right is uh, how he really appreciates food. He can really comment on uh, why food is good and why what he's feeling while he eats well food is great right yes it. yeah food is food is great and sushi he has no brains but uh, it tastes okay Ryuji needs a twitter feed no he doesn't <laughs> the last thing Ryuji needs is a twitter feed I don't see any prices listed here. <laughs> I don't see it. It's called market price. Don't worry about it, we got the cash. Called market price. Beauty. Well, Yusuke is anxious about the price because he doesn't have a lot of money, so he's looking at the price a lot. Meanwhile, Arn is in sushi heaven. Hey, is the fatty tuna ready yet? Get your horses and don't talk. By the way, is Boss really the kind of person who would abuse someone? My <laughs> sushi gasm. <laughs> I can't get it off my mind. Especially if it means he could be taken to court. What kind of person is he? Do you truly believe he'd do such and a thing? And is uh, sus suspecting of Boss being a bad person. Do you think that Boss is a bad person? I say no chance. Well, if you ask me, I don't. Nice guy. Hmm. But... So you If it's really true about the abuse, he'd be a no good jerk pretending to be a guardian. Makoto, why are you bringing this up <laughs> during dinner? No, he's good. Yes, he's good. I think he's a pretty cool guy. Maybe the chief is the one who needs a change of heart. Hold on a sec. About that, I actually got curious after our conversation and checked his name in the map. Sounds to me like there wasn't a hit. 
Right. Anything beyond this is his family's problem. We probably shouldn't get any more involved. See? Yeah, Sojiro got a good heart. The, me the metaverse doesn't react to him. Wait, you think Alibaba could be boss's ex-wife? <laughs> now Ryuji's suspecting Alibaba to be the boss's ex-wife. What do you think about that? Is everyone just ignoring Joker here? <laughs> Even Joker you know, ignores Joker. He must have cheated on her and I the think that's just a uh, failed uh, blame of it. Yeah, Ry yeah, Ryuji's mind is going somewhere else. Imagination has run rampant. How foolish. Mm. Still, this is delicious. I've never experienced anything. Because you have perpetually that. broke, Yusuke. Man, and it's all thanks to us being the fantasies. <laughs> you gee. Even the chef is looking, see? See, the chef is looking, the people are looking. Everybody is looking. Ryuji said that out loud. Uh, um, fantastic! This sushi is delicious. Just scream it around, Ryuji. Rap. Y yeah, the fish is so fresh. <laughs> Ryuji is being fucking idiot. He is fucking idiot supreme. Everywhere we go, we hear about these phantom thieves. What, Ryuji, please. Think about where we are, Ryuji. Sorry, it just kind of slipped. My apologies for bringing up Boss again. We should just enjoy the food. And we enjoy the food. Ijima san. Oh, what are you doing here? we met Akechi, and he is wearing a sweater. A uh, very boring looking sweater. While well, we have some de leftover sushi in our hands. Akechi kun. Akechi? Ak <laughs> Ryuji is so blonde. <laughs> the gold is brown in comparison. You're the ones from the TV station. Could it be that you're friends of Nijima san? Do you know this guy? It's nice to meet you. Sketchy. My name is Akechi. Glad to make your acquaintance. <laughs> and of course he knows the name. How do you know my name? Well, because I'm a psychic, of course. <laughs> I'm only joking. In truth, I'm a rookie detective. You're a former pupil of Madarame, right? I have actually just recently joined the investigation team looking into the Phantom Thieves. Why don't you just <laughs> do assert dominance? <laughs> just deposing. Did you see that Mejed has declared war on them? War? Their website was updated just a moment ago. Okay, for, for real. Oh, damn. Ah, English again. Wait, what? What to say? Get your damn drink. Yeah, I get, get my damn Why drink. Why do you seem so agitated? Oh, she's uh, a huge fan of the Phantom Thieves. Uh, a total nut job for her. For real? No, I need a drink. Hmm. I don't know how wise it is to be a fan of groups like them. Everyone is less than supple. What is with these comments? My apologies. I didn't mean to butt into your conversation. But I must say, this is an interesting group. Prosecutor Nijima's sister, an ex-pupil of Madarame, and a few Shujin Academy students. It seems you're all connected to the Phantom Thieves. Perhaps you have better intel than I do. Ah, yes. I wanted to ask you something. Regarding this whole Mejed commotion, 
If you were one of the phantom thieves, can't just run parallels? Ignore them. That is unexpected. Only That's a small a nice minority of people believe were. that is the best decision. Yeah, if I, yes, if I were one of the phantom thieves, I'm not, of course. Sorry to disappoint, but we're just normal high school kids. If anything, we want to hear what you got to say, Mr. Detective. My profiling of the Phantom Thieves has led me to believe they are a group of juveniles. They have a relative amount of free time after school and a hideout to slip away to. Furthermore, considering Kamashita was their first target, it seems they began activity around April. In a way, all I've just said about the Phantom Thieves coincides with the group you have here. Oh, Akechi having this very serious look on him. What? You gonna report us? I didn't say I was being suspicious of you. <laughs> Ryuji's a phantom thief. Me? You're siding with him? I wasn't anticipating that response. You will always find a way to rise above my expectations. You really are an intriguing one. I lack your calm mannerisms, but don't you think my deduction is an interesting one? I bet we'd make a great team if we worked together. Wink, wink. <laughs> it catches us winking at Joker. All, all cute to see, like. What the hell are you saying? I'm curious to hear what you have to say. You seem to be a wealth of information. In return, I'll teach you how to make deductions. I believe that is a fair trade-off for you. It seems like Akechi's interested in me. Level 2, rank up. Alright. Well, this has been a valuable point of reference for me. I hope to see you all again. ascertained our true identities? Nah, couldn't be. Right? I'd like to say that it's simply Yes, uh, I'm actually overstaying the um, stream best to be a bit, but bear with me here. We shouldn't forget that Alibaba was able to discover who we are. True, but it's not as though he had tangible evidence to prove that discovery. Just keep acting normally. More importantly, things are getting serious with Medjet. Oh yeah, what did they write? Here, I'll read it. We are disappointed in the people of Japan in their belief in the Phantom Thieves' false justice. Hence, we shall proceed with our plan to cleanse Japan. This process will commence on August 21st. As a result, the Japanese economy shall suffer devastating damage. And it's getting serious. Uh, for real, I don't I don't have a drink anymore. What what is this game? I shouldn't play a drinking game about Persona 5 and for real. Because And it's you have to drink again. Congratulate. Yes. We shouldn't play a drinking game about Persona 5 and for real. Do you have a drink? Keep going. However, we are magnanimous. At the moment, we will I give don't. the Phantom Thieves one final opportunity to repent. As proof of this repentance, we demand that they reveal their identities to the public. We will attack if these demands remain unmet. The future of Japan rests with the Phantom Thieves. We are Majed, we are unseen, we will eliminate evil. That's what it says. Sounds bad. In other words, if we don't unmask ourselves, Medjet will attack Japan, correct? And it seems they are quite the attention seekers. Attention wars. What are we gonna do about this? If only we could get in contact with Alibaba. Our only clues are Boss and Futaba. Anyways, it's too damn hot out here. Why don't we go to LeBlanc? We can talk more over there. E horse. We 
went through all sorts of options on our way here, but it looks like we got no choice but to ask for Alibaba's help. Question is, how do we get in touch with him? He cut off all contact with us after that misunderstanding. Then again, if we manage to steal Futaba's heart, he may attempt to reach out to us once more. But we don't have any clues on what her keywords are. Damn it, Alibaba! Where the hell are you? Actually, he may be closer than we think. Huh? Hypothetically speaking, even if we stole Futaba's heart, how would Alibaba know that the deed has been done? Would he truly be able to discern that just from cell phone messages? And the group is being very, uh... You mean he'd have to well, meet her in person? We're, f we're finally coming up with a plan here. After all that talking and dancing around the issue and gathering intel and being very, uh, stupid. Alibaba was able to deliver the calling card here. On top of that, he can check on Futaba's condition. However, according to the circumstances he put forth, he's unable to meet with us. This leads me to believe that it would be bad for him if we were to see the two of them together. It seems to me Alibaba may in fact be Futaba herself. And Nakura finally figured it out. <laughs> I don't have a drink anymore. I'm getting, I'm, uh, what I'm drinking right now is this Fanta Blood Orange. This makes for real. Four, uh, four reels. Four times. I think Ryuji never, ever, ever, so ever. So she's asking that we steal her own heart. Asking that we steal her heart. Just saying for real. Get a ten. Maybe she wants us to save her from the scars of her abuse. That would be hard to ask directly. I'd like to meet with Boss. He lives nearby, right? I know where his house is. I agree. It's real late, though. What are we gonna tell Boss when we get there? We'll say this takeout sushi is a gift for him. But my <laughs> oh, God, I want to save his fatty tuna. No complaining. Let's all go together. Boss may get the wrong idea if he and I show up alone. Yes, like Joker pretending to be Makoto's boyfriend. Hmm. If the lights are on. Come on. Even Boss would have woken up with how many times we've rung the doorbell. I think Butama would have answered by now if he showed here too. Gate is unlocked. Dude, you can't go opening other people's stuff like that. Alter, ich weiß, wo dein Haus wohnt. Geilster Scheiß. Look, uh, slightly open. That's very callous. Meow. Oh, it's not that going to rain. We should get inside. You are fee free, Yoshi. Hello, sir? He's not out, is he? The door ahead is open, and I can hear the TV. I hope he didn't pass out or something. I mean, boss is kind of old, ain't he? I'm a bit worried. Should we go in and check on him? Please excuse us. Ah! Ah! Scream! Poor guy. <laughs> and now we are all in a horror movie. How should I know? Did you hear that? Let's get out of here, please. Can we just go? What are you freaking out for? They're not totally freaking out, Tom. Could it be Alibaba? I mean, Futaba? Uh, sorry, um, can I? <laughs> Makoto is really, is, is completely freaking out. Who is it? Who's there? I 
take this anymore. I'm leaving. <laughs> I can't take this anymore. I'm leaving. I'm, 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 I go. I go. I go. I go. Please let me. Valeria. <laughs> This guy has a force, apparently. <laughs> my my god, being at, my, at her capacity. So fucking freaking out. Yeah. You? What are you doing in my house? <laughs> my daughter finally realizing that she's holding her to deal life on Joker's leg. <laughs> so she was just seeing this with no context. You are. Well, <laughs> it looks like it. <laughs> We're just friends. <laughs> friends nowadays get that close to each other? But that's not it. This, um, uh, things. <laughs> yes, things totally happened. <laughs> Kids are here too? Um, we brought you some sushi, but nobody answered when we rang the bell. The door was unlocked too. We could hear the TV though, so we got worried he might have passed out or something. The door was unlocked? Yes. <laughs> That's a fair assumption. She is hanging on his legs on her knees. <sighs> I do that sometimes. Because I'm getting old. Um, excuse me. There's something we'd like to ask. You want to ask me? There's someone else living here, isn't there? Yeah, my daughter. Could she be Butaba Sakura? You told Nijima-san too? Uh, um, is there any way we could meet with Butaba-san? I think we may have frightened her earlier, so... We'd like to apologize, if at all possible. Well, uh, that's... Is she sick? No, it's not like that. I don't want you all getting the wrong idea. I shouldn't have kept this a secret from you. Let's talk at my shop. She'll hear us if we stay here. She'll hear anyway. Yes, it's a lot of plot, and please bear with me here. Now, where do I start? Futaba's mother and I knew each other long before Futaba was born. Her mother was a bit of a weird one, but we got along well for some reason. She was sharp-witted, somewhat stern, a little socially inept, but always carefree. She truly great was sword a great woman. Talking yes, about someone being weird. Yep. I see. When something piqued her interest, that'd be all she focused on. She always worked deep into the night. I thought that'd change after her kid was born. But having Futaba didn't do much. Even with that, she always took good care of her. Working and watching over a child at the same time sounds rough. I guess raising Futaba alone turned out to be tough on her in more ways than one. 
There wasn't a father. Do you mean... Well, there probably was one. I didn't know him, though. She never said a word about him, either. She was single when she gave birth to Futaba, and single when she raised her. They were an ordinary, loving family. You could really tell how much she cared for Futaba. There probably was one, yeah. But one day, she left. Leaving Futaba behind. Yes. She committed suicide. Suicide? Threw herself into the street. Right in front of Futaba's eyes. Shocking doesn't begin to describe that. It's gotta be devastating for a kid. So... Well, a lot happened after that, but I ended up taking custody of Futaba. First, she was so depressed, she... she wouldn't even talk to me. Was that because she couldn't get over her mother's suicide? I kept talking to her, though, and she started opening up to me, little by little. That's when I found out Utaba blames herself for her mother's death. What? But why? That part she's never told me. I wanted to know what led her to believing that. But I decided not to rub salt. As in opposed to what everyone is doing to Ryuji here. Then, a few months ago, she started getting real scared. Even when nothing was happening, she'd say things like, I hear voices and mom is looking at me. Visual and auditory hallucinations. Have you taken Futaba to a doctor? I wanted to. 10 euros she on Ryuji's saying for real. I had a doctor come, she locked herself away in the room. Since then, she's become what you'd call a shut in. She won't take a single step outside the house, or even try to see other people. What about you? She doesn't even let me come in her room. That's pretty harsh. Futaba is, well, a unique girl. She's so quick minded that conversations with her tend to jump from one topic to the next. It seems like she's always coming to conclusions in her head. There's a lot I don't get about her. Hmm. So, yeah, her situation is why I couldn't let you in my house. I understand. What Futaba needs is a safe place where nobody will threaten her. Somewhere she can be at ease. That's why I won't do anything she doesn't want. I don't make her do anything she's unwilling to, either. And again, I know that's no way for her to live. It's all I can do, though. I don't know. She just asks me for things that she wants, like food or these complicated books. Well, that's that. So, can you just leave her be? I'm gonna head back then. You all had better head home soon, too. I feel awful for prying into his personal affairs. No way in hell he's abusing her. The reason why Futaba wants her heart stolen must be related to what happened to her mother. So she'd like to discard her feelings of pain, but can't do anything about it herself. Will changing her heart really help her, though? If we can help her, we may be able to stand up to Medjet. It's possible. Hold on a sec, do we even know if she has a palace? Yeah, um, this is a big plot event, and I really hope that I can't save Sue. Let's check. The Futaba Sakura that lives at Sojiro Sakura's house. Is that gonna be enough? Ah, she has a palace. What the? She's got one. So someone can have a palace even if they're not evil? Hey, Morgana. Where's Morgana? I haven't seen him for some time. So, ever since we went inside Boss's house? Somewhere around there. He'll be fine, though. See? Even Ryuji agrees that uh, Morgana's a cat. The 
trains are going to be shutting down for the night soon, so we should probably be heading home. Well, he's a cat. We have after to go all. to school in the morning after yeah. all. Oh, right. The urgent assembly. An assembly? What about? Shujin has been garnering a lot of attention ever since Medjed called out the Phantom Thieves. So, they need to remind us not to say arbitrary stuff online and add more fuel to the fire. We gotta meet up for every goddamn little thing. <sighs> Talk about a pain in the ass. I mean, it is our fault. Anyway, let's contact each other afterward. No way in hell he's abusing her. The reason why Futaba wants her heart stolen must be related to what I think you can call it a break. So she likes yeah, but I can't save yet. Pain, but can't do anything about I, I wanted to have a break like 20 minutes ago, but I can't. If we can help her, we you can in some stand up to measure. Hold on a sec, let's check. The Futaba Sakura that lives at Sojiro Sakura's house. Is that gonna be enough? What the? She's got one. So someone can have a palace even if they're not evil? Hey, Morgana. <laughs> ah, that was a cat. I can finally save. Where'd Morgana go? I can save. Oh, Fuck Morgana, I can save. <laughs> so guys, yes, uh, thanks for overstaying. Um, we had a lot of plot today. And that's this. actually what I told you, that you have a chance to save in some second. Yes, I want to. I can, yes, we can sleep. We can all sleep today. Yes, um... Thief of Hearts and Thief of Privacy. Yes, um, thanks everybody for uh, joining tonight. And yeah, uh, thanks Mark for being here and commenting on Ryuji being a dick and an idiot. And Morgana being a cat, of course. And um, yeah, I'll see you, all you guys tomorrow for a Pokemon Mystery Dungeon, where we are gonna continue the adventures of a Cave of Elf. And we're gonna save the second time. Yes. Yes, you can watch everything on YouTube later when I upload it. So, everybody chill, it's fine. And yeah guys, see ya, see ya, bye!